My name is Walter Zahn. Uh, I moved to the US in 2000 uh, from Germany and uh, started my own consulting boutique here in the US in 2004. Up to then, I had done about 15 years of SAP consulting and project management. The company I represent is uh, Mass Movement, which is a white glove, last mile fitness equipment installer with six warehouses in the US. And also, I have another uh, pet project with Redwork, which is my own startup project. Uh, it's Smart Bicycle Parking, where I'm going to launch um, to market later this year in 2019. So the, <clears throat> the project at Mass Movement, um, let me describe their business first uh, very briefly. What they do is they consolidate fitness equipment uh, from a multitude of manufacturers, which is to be installed in uh, fitness gyms. They pre-assemble it in their own warehouses, they deliver the last mile, and then they install it, and that all is a white cloth service. That means um, they leave the place cleaner and provide superior service. And um, this business requires a high amount of flexibility in process and planning because they really depend on their manufacturers. They don't have their own products. They provide services. So the, the project approach um, for which we also needed Redworks uh, services is that uh, we moved away from an ERP system that had been installed 10 years ago now to a best-in-class approach with all cloud components available today that made a lot of sense. And uh, some of the core components, like the one for resource planning, um, had to be delivered as a custom piece from Redwork. Uh, there were other components as well, um, not as core, like certain interfaces, inventory management uh, components and so on, that also were provided by Redwork as custom software. Well, let me describe um, the vendor selection. Uh, so I compiled a short list of possible service providers um, before we started the project at Mass Movement um, almost a year ago. And um, part one of the vetting process were simply interviews. So I had a short list of companies, service providers. Um, I interviewed them all and uh, decided to go with Redwork because the interview was definitely the best uh, between the companies that were on the shortlist. And part two of the vetting process was a small project that I had defined for Redwork, and I monitored that very closely. And um, all uh, parameters that were important, that means quality, timeliness, um, communication, documentation, and so on, um, were really, um, done perfectly well by Redwork, by the Redwork team. And uh, that was the, the process that I followed through. I had done that before with other companies as well. And that was the process to choose Redwork. I have to uh, describe maybe the specificities of how I work. So I do the customer facing project management. So that means I develop the scope with my customer and I write the detailed spec. Redwork's role is to do the internal project management then for after the handover for development, QA and delivery. And here the results are really outstanding. The deliverables are on time, definitely more than 80% of the cases. The delay in the remaining cases, they may be a day or two and they have never been more than one week. We also have a regular status call every week with the account manager and the technical lead from Redwork. And um, that really works out perfectly well. Documentation uh, is done in a high quality uh, way. And so there are really no complaints um, regarding the usual hiccups that I've run into when working with external service providers here. Um, really well, I have to say there were very rare instances where something got lost in translation, so to speak. Uh, because remember, uh, none of us is a native speaker in English. Uh, I'm a German native. Um, your team um, also is not native to the English, English language. So this makes projects really prone to, to run into a situation where something doesn't, um, isn't understood in the way it's meant to be. 
However, these were really rare, rare instances. And uh, in any case where that happened, they were all caught very promptly. And there was not one major setback um, that, um, uh, that occurred so far. So I would have to say, I'll have to say that the team really dealt very well with the assignments that, um, that were at hand. Well, having worked with many external service providers in my professional life so far, I can clearly say that Redwork comes out on top. And Redwork's customer-facing team that I'm dealing with, um, being in the middle between my customer and uh, Redwork, Redwork's customer-facing team is really very professional. And besides that, it's also fun to work with, I have to say. 